All right, ladies and gentlemen, I hope you guys are doing absolutely amazing today. In today's video, we're gonna be talking about TradingView's possibly biggest update for 2019, and that is the bar replay that now supports switching time frames while replaying. So now before the old bar replay, you could only ever use one time frame, and it sucked. It really, you really couldn't use it for bar, uh, you really couldn't use it if you're a multiple time frame analysis trader. Um, this is really a big update for TradingView and it's going to help a lot of people that don't want to pay the extra money for uh, back testing softwares that cost 100 bucks or 200 bucks. So this is a great alternative. It's free for everybody. Now if you want to find it, you're going to go to the top of your screen. It's going to be under Bar Replay. And I'm sure most of us know how to use it already, but wherever you click, it's going to take you directly back to that time. So if we want to click right here, it will take us directly back to that time. So maybe we want to be drawing zones on these uh, higher time frame trades if you're a multiple time frame analysis trader like I am personally or maybe you just want to be aware of the higher time frames this will allow you to use it now because you can now switch into multiple time frames so if we want we're gonna let this play and maybe we want to highlight this whole zone just just work with me for a second and then we can switch to the one hour and click play and it will leave off exactly where it is we can speed it up just like that. And maybe we want to switch back to the four hour now. So you're like, oh, I like a trade setup. Go to the four hour, and boom, you can see the four hour setup. This is really, this is honestly a great update for TradingView. It's about time they made this update. Shout out to those guys. And if you guys use multiple time frame analysis, you guys can use it for all your analysis too. You guys can pause it, you can go back to the higher time frame of whatever you call a higher time frame, and you're like, hey, well, maybe I want to be looking up here now. Just draw that out. Draw it across, push play. Maybe you want to draw support and resistance. Maybe you want to add some indicators. There's nothing wrong with that. And then you can play it. Now, it would be really cool if TradingView made in the future, and I think they're, they're about to make it in the future. I'm sure they will. Is back testing, but you can have an, a buy and sell button, and you can adjust your order flow, and it will tell you after, you know, after 10, 20 trades how you're doing. And that would be really great. That will eliminate all back testing that could possibly knock out all the other softwares in the business. But also it'd be really cool if they could have multiple time frames. I don't believe you can do that where you can draw, say we go up to two time frames or maybe you want to use three. We'll use two. So we have gold here, we have gold on both charts. So you can't go back. If you have your, your bar replay going on one time frame, you can't, you can't look at the other one on the right. So that would be a pretty cool update if they made that in the future. But for right now, you can only use one time frame and just go like that, which is still great. You're just gonna have to switch time frames onto your one hour chart. There's nothing wrong with that. But this is really is a groundbreaking update for them. And that's all I wanted to talk to you guys about. Switch time frames, anything like that, and it'll hold its current spot. You can go fast, you can go slow. Bars can go every three seconds, every five seconds. But that's it. That's all I wanted to show you guys with this. Hopefully you enjoy. Let me know in the comments below if you guys really liked the update. I think it really is a groundbreaking update for TradingView right now. All right. Cheers, guys. Bye-bye.